tell just one police squad car, but we know in the aftermath of this shooting, one man in his late 20s is dead, and at least four people, possibly as many as six people, are injured after this mass shooting at the Indian Lakes Hotel right behind me. We need the same unit that we can on the sixth floor. We have two shots in the abdomen up here, one with one in the arm. One on the fifth floor, shot in the abdomen as well, I believe. Got off the phone with OG this morning, she told me stop going live. I told OG she tweaking the ops that he dissing the gas. Moms, you fry, you know what I mean? Life's on why? Fuck them, mom, they ass gon' die, that's on the gas. Rest in Fuck the ops, they not outside, police, they posted on the draft. Just got off the phone with OG this morning, she told Slash, she likes them, why? Fuck them, mom, they ass gon' die, that's on the gas. Rest in peace, Richie Perks, we dropping wise. Fuck the ops, they not outside, police, they... Public safety tells me around 2.30 in the morning, police got a call of shots fired here at the hotel where many people appeared to be gathering. No word on what this large group was doing at the property at this point, but investigators say people were seen fleeing from the area as officers arrived in the aftermath. Those fleeing may have included one or more suspects, according to the official I spoke with, though at this point, authorities say no one is in custody. Police say multiple victims were taken to area hospitals. One man who was among those transported to a hospital later died, according to police. As the night progressed, the gear started getting more and more. The next thing you know, they're in SWAT gear, full riot gear, M16s or whatever they're using these days but they, they had some serious gear and they're going in and they're yelling at me keep driving keep driving those are the the thoughts of a man who we spoke with in the aftermath this morning around 5 a.m he says he saw what was unfolding around 3 a.m up until around 4 a.m and I asked the public safety director why we would have continued to see an increase of police personnel well after the initial call and as he explained to me, they were trying to figure out if there were more victims, possible suspects inside this building behind me. And you can see it's pretty big, Stacy and Mark. So you can imagine there were a lot of rooms that might have had to be checked one by one. And so police continue to bring more personnel in as needed to make sure that they were able to effectively check out this entire scene. And for hours, police continued to search the property. I'm still trying to figure out if they've completed their search. So if we get that information, we will bring it to you. But again, at this point, we know one man in his late 20s is dead, at least four, possibly six people injured after this mass shooting incident. And police are still trying to figure out who is responsible for what happened here overnight. We've also reached out to the hotel, and if we get an, any update or statement from them, we will bring that to you as well.